Yeah, I'm getting ready to leave the park. It's Dobson Ranch Park. Finally caught some fish here. I've been drove past this park several times. Here it goes. That sign. I took pictures of it. I don't know if you could read it and see it. I don't know. Maybe you could read it and see it. Yes. There's a Dobson Ranch on the other side, too. There goes the park again. I'm leaving it. Got some nice basketball courts out here. It's not bad at all. Golf course. It's too hot to um, to do anything else out here now. To be honest with you. I'm back in my car. Yeah, I met the Indian brother. Let me put my windows up. Yeah, I met the Indian brother. He, uh, we talked for about an hour and a half. I got his number. We changed numbers. Everybody has a story. And uh, that's what I'm going to start doing. Start paying more attention to my people. He's in Navajo. My people is Cherokee and black. And his wife is a very spiritual woman. He's like 41. The other guy I met the other day, he's 50, 51, I think. I told him, man, you, you ain't, you're not young anymore. That's over. That stuff is over. I had some blueberry crap on my car. I took it off. Yeah, I told him, I said, that's over, man. You're a grown man now. Yeah, he was talking about his health. He's afraid of his health. He, he needed, we need, I needed to talk to him. I told him sugar is poison. It tastes good, but it's still poison. What we got here, we got a spider in here. That's it. This guy been in my car for a long time. He's done now. That guy been in my car so long. Every time I come in, it's webs. Oh boy, this air conditioning feels good. I'm glad that uh, I got to get a car wash too. There's some kind of cherry crap all over my car. See, there's a lot of, uh, not a lot, but I've seen a couple of homeless people in this park since this morning. It's like, what is it, 1040 now? Yeah, this guy looks like a, he's going to come from behind that wall. He looks like he's looking on the ground. He's a drug addict. There's a firehouse right over here, and there's a, um, a precinct, Mesa police. So remember I'll tell you that Tempe and Mesa is like a cross on one another? Yesterday I went to Tempe. No, that was Saturday. Today I went opposite of that. So now I see that Tempe is better. And I did see a couple of people laying around in the grass in, in that Tempe Kiwanis Park. So I got a picture of my, the fish I caught and I took a video of it. I'll upload those to that site. Yeah, that fish ashed out. He tried to, um, he was flopping around too much. I should have had my camera ready, my phone ready. I had to get going there and look for him. So he was out of the water a little. He swam away. He didn't go away floating. He swam away. He was outside for about a minute and a half. He still was flopping around. So I'm getting ready to get up out of here.
it's really too hot to go anywhere else. Where's my car? So my car says 99 degrees outside. And I fish in the shade. I'll I be in the, underneath the shady tree casting. Well, peace and love, y'all. Y'all have a good day. Talk to you next time. I'm out.